life a promise. I won't quit, keep going till I got it. Hey, hey, y'all. Welcome back to my channel, Tidy with Toya. This is your girl, Toya. And in today's video, y'all, we are doing a cash reallocation or unstuffing of a challenge I completed or a couple challenges I completed, as well as some happy mail. So we are going to start first with the happy mail. Let's get this cracking, y'all. I have been waiting for this Happy Mail. This piece of Happy Mail is from Wendy over at the Thrifty Sewers. Okay, I've already cut it open. I have not peeked in it or anything. So, um, let's see what we got going on, y'all. Okay. All right, just making sure one one nothing else lingering in there. Okay, y'all. So. This challenge is actually the, um, it's based off of the game Dream Phone. I'll put a little um, uh, picture of the game um, on the screen. Um, so Wendy is very, very creative and she um, recreated some, um, some like nostalgic childhood games and this is one of the games that she recreated y'all and i played this game all the time so let me know down in the comments if you've ever played dream phone like i played the game so much y'all that i had to start writing on regular pencil and paper um because i used all the paper within the, the game so anyway um all right y'all so the way the game works is that basically um, you get clues via the telephone, which is why it's called Dream Phone. And um, you use the clues to eliminate these different guys to figure out who your crush is. Okay. Um, and then Wendy has these little clues that you scratch off and that's the amount that you say that's next to them. And then at the end, it'll tell you who your dream date is. But as you go through you you know um will eliminate the guy so sometimes it's you know this guy doesn't wear glasses and so then that would mean that kevin is eliminated stuff like that and so that would be what some of the clues are and i just eliminate as i go and then at the end i'll save however much so i'm excited to start that challenge y'all and we will be um okay what else we got in here y'all I don't remember ordering an envelope. I wonder if I really did. <laughs> Wendy, did I order an envelope? <laughs> I can't. Honestly, y'all, I don't remember. Like, because I saw the game and then I went in and favorited it. And then I was like, as soon as I have the money, I'm, I'm buying and then I bought it. So I don't even remember what the heck I bought. Okay. There is a sticker in here too. Let me see what this sticker says. It says, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness. I love it. Thrifty Sois, thank you for your order. Find me on YouTube. That is so cute, Wendy. Oh my goodness. And I think this is the group that the cards came from. So that's the B group. Okay, a little scratcher live like you were dying oh my god that is that's a great one spring into savings each icon is worth however much you save for spring i love that one yes okay dream day okay y'all i don't even know okay so envelope came with it um i wonder if envelope actually came with it or now i don't remember y'all but i love it i got an envelope too cool 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 Oh my goodness, I love it. I can't wait to get started on this. This is excellent. I'll put that. I'll put these somewhere else. And then I'll actually wrap this all up together. Well, thank you all for opening the Happy Meal with me. If you have not been to um, Wendy's shop over at the Thrifty Sewers, please check it out. She is very, very creative and has lots of great challenges in her shop. So I definitely encourage you to check that out. Now we will go back to the regularly scheduled video, which is the cash reallocation. And I actually recorded this video separate from that one. So that's why we kind of splicing them together, y'all. So let's hey, go. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Toya and over here on this channel, we like to keep it tidy. 
with our home, with our budget, and with our life. And if you're returning, welcome back. I thank you so much for your support, for your comments, for your love, everything, y'all. I promise. Like, this community is like no other, okay? So, y'all, let's go ahead and hop into this cash reallocation. Um, so, I do have $205 to reallocate towards... Um, other areas. I have $3 that was just an extra $3 from another savings, a short shaving savings challenge video that I did to make it 208. And then I have $6 and $2 bills that I got over from hopping in a budget with Bunny that I'm going to put into um, an and uh, a special envelope because I'm going to hold on to those. Okay, y'all. So let's go ahead and get it started. First, let me go ahead and moisten up these tips, y'all. This came from um, Erica over at Black and Blue. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and count this cash up. So we got the $2 bills right here. I'm going to take these and put these here just because we're going to take care of those first, y'all. Okay, so pull my calculator out. We got 50 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. All righty. So 193. Now I know you're saying 20. I thought you said it was like 208 plus $6. Um, 20, about, no, $15 of this went to um getting some hair stuff for my daughter um i do need to wash both of the twins heads this weekend and so i had to get some hair stuff for her um uh for for this weekend basically so um we're going to go ahead and sort this money out how are y'all doing today i'm filming this on a saturday i'm doing a little bit of bulk filming i filmed my march madness video today as well so tell me in the comments how y'all are doing today. Today, I actually went and did a little um, shopping um, at Sam's. And then I also um, will be going out to the stores again after the twins wake up from their nap to finish up my shopping. So y'all, we are going to start with my occasions binder that I have newly created. Um, and we're gonna just start stuffing it, okay? So, um, I have holiday candy here. I actually have a little tracker for Easter, um, but I like to add money here because um, we like to get holiday candy after the holiday's over because it's cheaper. <laughs> so, after Easter, we plan to go and get some candy. So, one, two, three, four, five. Um, how do I want to do this, y'all? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then a five. So 15 is going towards holiday candy. Y'all, right now I am surrounded by a little bit of chaos around my house. Um, I pride myself on, you know, making sure that, um, my house is in order, you know, like things are clean, clothes are folded and put away, you know, all that kind of stuff. But since having twins, y'all, it has been a struggle, okay? Um, and especially in this toddler stage, it's really been a struggle. Let me know in the comments if any of you moms out there are struggling with just trying to balance it all, you know? Uh, for Mother's Day, I'm putting $20. And I actually need to figure out how much my goal is for this, but um, I got this challenge uh, from Just Roll It and Glitter. Well, not challenge, but tracker. Um, so I'm gonna put $20 in Mother's Day since this is coming up. Um, I, um, you know, I work full time my husband works full time. His job is very physical. And so a lot of times when he comes home, he does not have the energy or the capacity to do much at home either. And so it just kind of piles up. And then also we just have a lot of stuff too, that I would like to start getting rid of as well. So 
it's just a lot y'all that I am trying to juggle sometimes I don't feel like tidy with Toya is like my mantra anymore like I need to change it to you know um Toya's tenacious life let me know in the comments if you uh if you like that idea or not but I just there's just so much that um that I do and sometimes tidy is not at the top of my list so tenacious is more my flavor you know because I, I don't give up you know whenever I, I set my mind to do something I'm gonna do it you know it may not get done immediately but it will get done um, so for gifts y'all I'm allocating ten dollars for this and I'm gonna see how much I have here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen so I'm going to take a dollar to make it 20, right, y'all? Follow me. But then I'm going to take this 20 out and put these dollars back. And then um, I'm going to stuff um, $9 in here. So five, actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. So this should make this. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Had X dollar there. So, y'all, let me know what y'all think about the, the channel name change. I mean, I know that, you know, Tidy with Toya um, has really, it really rolls off the tongue, but to, to, Toya's Tenacious Life does as well. And I just think it better represents me now. So, um, I don't have anything else to stuff for that binder i'm gonna move over to my family binder and in this one y'all for anniversary or i'm sorry um date night but anniversary is coming up we are contributing 50 dollars to this one and this one now has 55 six um our anniversary is april 21st the twins birthday is april 4th <laughs> How do we do that y'all but anyways it happens jack stacks is a barbecue spot here and so um we may use that for date night instead of um using the money or at least not using as much of the money um in family we're also going to stuff 50 dollars okay y'all let's see what i got going on in here Ten, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that is fifty. Yeah. Like I said, the twins' birthday is April fourth, and so we wanted to put a good amount of money towards this so we can be ready for their birthday. So twenty, forty. 55 65 75 85 90 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 107 and family ooh ooh y'all um ooh it's getting it's getting a little real in this in this envelope putting all these ones in there um we're not doing anything for fun. Nothing for Jamila. Um, Nana is going to get $8. Um, and this is actually for my mother-in-law, y'all. Um, sometimes she requests that I go and get her little treats before I pick the twins up from her house. And so um, this fund is you know, to keep her happy because I know uh, having them all day long is a feat in and of itself. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 in her fund now. And I'll update these trackers, y'all, off camera. Alrighty. And then we're going to go to Home and Auto. So in Home and Auto, y'all. Car maintenance is going to get $20. I'm just going to take that solid 20, slap that in there. Okay. Electronics, furniture is not getting anything. Household isn't getting anything. Costco is not either, but grocery stockpile is going to get 
seven, so five. Actually, you know what? Grocery stockpile is going to get 10 for that extra $3 that I hadn't put anywhere. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Because I had that extra $3 that I, for, that I didn't actually allocate yet. All right. And grocery stockpile had nothing in it. And then home repairs. Um, so currently we are renting but um, sometimes maintenance just takes forever um, and we actually do have to change our own filter for the ac slash heat um, and then i typically will change out the bulb above the stove um, any light bulbs stuff like that is what this home repairs is for so we got five hold on y'all did i miss a category I put the extra 10 there so I should only have five why do I have an extra five dollars mm, 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 mm. I put three grocery stockpile okay y'all I'm what I'm gonna do is it five six seven eight nine ten I'm gonna put that um, in here and home repairs and just call it a day okay it got 10 instead of five all righty okay y'all and then for the two dollar bills that i got over from hopping in a budget with bunny um so i actually have this challenge this is from reinventing renee um and this is the l buck challenge okay so i'm gonna start collecting l books um i probably should have did that is, well, whatever we'll, we'll start with the next one if I see any L bucks and other challenges I'll probably switch them out however um, these two dollar bills y'all have L's on them okay so I'm not going to use them I'm going to keep them and I'm not going to actually put them on this tracker because this tracker is going to be for debt um, uh, one time I'll do it for debt another 25 will be for me I'll, I'll alternate um, but I'm gonna just leave them in this envelope or in this yeah in this envelope um, and they'll just be there for whenever um, my grandmother also has some two dollar bills to give me for the twins for their birthday so I'll be leaving those in their envelopes I'll split them up um, and they'll just kind of sit there until we figure out you know if anything can be done with them okay so y'all over here on this channel you know um, we like to use our money to save, right? Because I have not saved, but before August of 2022, when I started this last year, like saving was not in my nature. So to save, pay off debt. And then we are also trying to buy um, a house as well. And so I do have some funds set aside for a um, new house and um, I'm actually going to be starting a challenge to go along with that house savings okay and adding my husband's budget to our funds will be beneficial to help save for that house so I can't wait for the next um, budget with me so you all can see how I allocate my funds plus my husband's funds and then I'll talk a little bit more about the challenge that I'm starting to save for the house. Okay. So if you all enjoyed this video, please make sure you like it and hit me up in the comments and look at some other videos of mine. And if you're feeling my vibe, um, then subscribe. We definitely would love to have you as part of our family here on YouTube. Um, I would like you to follow my journey as we save money, pay off debt and eventually buy a house. All right, so I hope you all have a beautiful day. And remember, keep it tidy. Bye. Never stop, I'll get it if I want it. Gotta make to myself a promise. I won't quit, keep going till I got it. I won't give up till I'm.